Hi, this is an unboxing of the and first impressions of the new 2012 Shiny, Shiny Plates, nail plates. And they were $11.99 from Amazon, a set of 25. And right off the bat, um, this is the box they came in. Uh, I had tried to previously record this video, and when I started going through the plates, they weren't in any order. So even though that's not a really big deal, it was just kind of annoying to have to put them back in order. Um, inside the box, there was a request to do reviews, and all the plates came in this, um, this one package in this box. So... Now I'll do a first impressions of the plates, a first glimpse. Okay, on SH01, there's the word sexy. You can see me in the background. <laughs> sexy, then it looks like there's uh, geometric squares, a flower with little flares coming out the side, a snowman, spider web, a crane and a hibiscus and again I haven't taken the blue off this is just me opening the package explaining each plate um, the stamping on each plate right when they come out of the package after this video I'll do a review on the quality of the stamping okay on image two there's theater um, tragedy and comedy fishbone Scream face, a skull and crossbones, a witch, a black cat, and a pumpkin. On the third plate, there's footprints. Uh, looks like some swirl design with the star, a swan like a gnome or Santa Claus looks almost like a constellation or a galaxy wings and flowers with little stems on plate four there's an Egyptian eye um, it looks like a little maybe a duck or some kind of little face over the edge I guess for the tip of the nail, a flower, a starburst, another little face, one with a bow, and this one does not have a bow, a seashell, like a nautilus, some flower with some gradient coming off the back. On plate five, there's some little swirly design, a butterfly, a flower with flares, um, almost like a Mobius strip design, another hibiscus, a butterfly, and some little leaves with little dots on the side. Plate six is a French tip plate. Um, it's just a plain bar with a swirl, a plain tip, tips with little dots on the side, a netting, little polka dots, and this is gradient polka dots on the French tip. The next plate is SH7. It's just numbers and some symbols and two horses. They remind me of the Jordash horse from the 80s. All right. Plate SH08. Um, a little kitty cat. It looks almost like a generic, like Hello Kitty. Um, uh, like an alley cat figure. Puppy. Crescent moon and some stars. A baby. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe. What is that? It looks like some kind of little penguin or maybe a little chick. Little paw prints. Plate nine. Spider. A skull on a cross with some um, flares coming out. A money sign. A bikini. A flower with some little designs coming out of it. An anchor. 
and a pretty cool demoness with a pitchfork. Okay, this is plate 10. You have another one of those kind of generic flower stamps, butterfly. Can't tell if that's supposed to be, a, I guess maybe like some wheat, some leaf plant, um, some kind of circle design, a squirrel. I think that's a squirrel. Let me focus. No. There we go. There it's focused. A little flare and some butterflies. Okay, this is plate 11. On this plate, there's some, it looks almost like interlocking chain, more paw prints. Um, another like generic star or flower with little swirls, a heart with this animal print, maybe some zebra print, another flower, another flower with swirls, and these are just like some beachy swirls, or waves I guess. This one is plate SH-12, it has a heart Shamrock, Smiley Face, Ladybug, I think this is a bird, um, and some flowers, some more flowers, and then a little flower line. Okay, plate 13, there's a star, um, a like if the in between a French tip and the skin part, I can't remember what that's called. <laughs> a lizard, um, again, like a firework or a constellation, some butterflies, some flowers with a little scroll design. Oh, a, a reindeer and a flower. This is plate 14. They're zodiac symbols with a skull and instead of the crossbones, cross swords. Okay, this is plate 15. Some scroll accents, a scroll cross. Um, maybe a leaf border, a heart, two hearts with some tribal designs, flower, and then like a single tribal design. This is plate, uh, plate 16, some blocks in the center, roses, another one of those flower designs, another flower design, an eye, another flower, and another flower. This is plate 17. Some hearts, flowers with little swirls on the side. Another one of those, I guess it's supposed to be like a, like a fern, a snowflake, flowers with a swirl design, that bird looks it looks like a hummingbird like that but then it has these legs and I don't know if that's trying to be like the Hunger Games Mockingjay it's just kind of a funky bird some little flowers okay this is plate 18 SH 18 Okay, it has a, a full image of flowers, some more little flowers, a little bar with dots, mm, like some kind of lily type flower, 
more flowers, more flowers, and more flowers. Plate 19, a palm tree on a beach, some swirls, a little tropical fish, a kite, a strawberry, some lips, and a treble clef. Music note. Here's some full image stamps on plate SH20. Has a, a paisley flower design, a French tip of hearts, some flower full design leaves, some cross lines with some flowers, and more flowers with lines coming out. Plate 21 again is full image stamps. Um, this is some tribally kind of swirls. I'm not exactly sure if these are supposed to be dragonflies. Um, another flower, full design, two lace, and some butterflies. This doesn't look centered. Uh, plate 22. Some really funky, like 80s <laughs> geometric triangle shapes. More of those, like ferns in a full image. Some circles. Um, I guess it could be whatever, but it doesn't really look like animal print. It looks more like seaweed. <laughs> and then um, almost like an Art Deco. French tip. Plate 23, some lines. This is interesting. It looks like a beach with the water coming up on the sand. I don't know if that's what it's supposed to be, but that's what it looks like. A crisscross and a very small crisscross French tip. Some line dots and gradients. And I'm not really sure, maybe some a wood design. It's SH-23. SH-24. Um, some, like, Caladium Ivy. Again, that kind of generic flowers with the swirls and the dots. Um, I guess this is supposed to be, like, a peacock feather. Some flowers. Um, I guess, like, a side stamp. Um, a swirly, trebly type of butterfly and some scroll swirlies. And then for the last one, their full image again, SH25, another French tip, some spider webs with spiders, leopard print, some flowers in a geometric design full image, and tribally kind of full images. Um, the first impressions of these stamps are they might not be the quality that we see in the higher end, well not higher end, just different plates as far as I don't think they're going to be the quality of Conad. Um, I haven't tried them yet, this is just first impressions, but they don't have any backing. Um, they did put this plastic, the blue coating on the back so it doesn't make it as sharp. Um, the images are, aren't very clear, some of them are very hard to decipher, and there are very, very many, um, similar or repeat patterns, um, especially with the flowers. Again, they didn't come in order, they came in one package all together, um, which is just, you know, again, it's, it's, not anything bad they you know they came intact uh, it's just a little frustrating that they were out of order and it's frustrating that they have similar images on um, a lot of the plates um, another thing is the plates are hard to tell what the images are but I guess it all comes down to how they stamp so I will be making another video um, showing the stamp quality in comparison to previous Shaney stamps plates that have come out and in comparison to other brands like Conad, Bundle Monster, and MASH. Alright, look out for the next video. Thanks!